Omar Don Collins, welcome to the show. Thank you, Mikali. <laughs> Saudi Merudi, <laughs> are you feeling better? <laughs> yeah, I'm feeling better. It's not you as know, cold. it's a season of cold, so yes, we have to find yes. a way to keep ourselves warm. Warm a bit. Yeah. Okay. So you bring us a book today. Yes. It's called Morning Shall, Shall Come. Come. Yeah. Yes. And I like what is written here. It tickles the heart, provokes the mind, uplifts the, the soul, and it's it's um, subtle poetry. Poetry. Yes, it is poetry. Okay. Poetry, poetry, poetry. Let and this is poetry <laughs> defined. I mean, if you if you read this, yes. My what goodness. do you mean? What do you mean? Please tell us. <laughs> what do you mean? Poetry redefined. Uh, What's in here? What is in there is things or thoughts that you can relate to. Okay. Most of the times, I've had responses from people after reading the pieces, and they say. What are you talking about, me? Also, the chair said, uh, maybe or maybe not. What do you think? Oh, no. Are they your friends? That would be, I'll be so careful around you. <laughs> people who are friends, people who are not friends. Yes. But people who, who just, you know, pick a piece, then read it, then they text back and say, my goodness. What were you talking about? I'm blessed about that I've I read about this. And yeah. I said, oh, I'm blessed that you're able to get it and I was able to put it across to you. Okay, yeah. okay. So at the back <laughs> of this book, mm -hmm. let me just read because it's very interesting. Yeah. It says, struggle is not new to humanity. Mm -hmm. It has and always will be part of us, whatever form it takes, but the pain. the pain. Struggle measures our resilience and builds our fortitude. Mm -hmm. The more we overcome, the better we become. become. Therefore, hold on. It is only for a while. Give it another push. Try it differently, maybe. Rest if you must, but do not give up. Morning Shall Come is about rising above struggle. It's a spring of hope and reassurance for better days ahead. It picks on the little everyday things that make life beautiful. It tickles the heart, provokes the mind, and uplifts the soul. This is yeah. <laughs> intriguing. You know, when you talk about struggle, that is exactly what, we, like, we are all struggling with one thing or the other. Yes. And we were just talking earlier about setting boundaries. <laughs> and we want to set them up because we're struggling with something. Uh -huh. And we're choosing us because mm -hmm. when you take away that from our spaces, then we'll feel better mm -hmm. about ourselves. But it doesn't mean that we didn't struggle. It's true. We did. We did struggle. And you see, Mukali, humans and, uh, are beings of struggle. Mm-hmm. And that you cannot run away from. Yeah. We are beings of struggle. When you're, st when you're, when you're not struggling about one thing, mm -hmm. you'll be struggling about another. Yes. We are in a continuous motion of struggle that in is one way or another. a thing to look at and focus, <laughs> focus on. Like there are other things. You could <laughs> think about love and how we Even are. in love, <laughs> we there still is struggle. struggle. <laughs> so we are nature of struggle. Yes. So it... Yes. What... what, what what brings even more struggle, but yes. bad struggle in our lives, yeah. is that we want to imagine that we should not have struggle. Okay. Yet we are humans of struggle. We are beings of struggle. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. Victor Franklin, if you read Man's Search for Meaning, mm -hmm. he'll tell you that humans are, nature, are beings of struggle. Mm -hmm. When you're struggling to get love mm -hmm. and finally get love, yes. you'll struggle to make it healthy. Yeah. After you make it healthy, you struggle to make it prosper. After you make it, po after you achieve everything you want, you still struggle to find meaning for life. And it will kill you if you don't find meaning for life. Yes. You'll have billions, Mikhail, in your account. But if you don't have meaning for life, it's another struggle that you cannot. So this is we are beings of struggle. And this is what you talk about in the different many yeah. pieces in here. Yeah. yeah. Is so this really like your main focus or other things that you talk about as well? You know, I, I know this, I is, this is the one we have here today, <laughs> but let's just see if there's something else out there. Well, from I talk about human struggle, yeah. but I advocate for humanity. Okay. In the sense that in our struggle mm -hmm. to be what we want to be, mm -hmm. in our struggle to become who we want to be, yes. or achieve whatever we want to achieve, mm -hmm. sometimes we do it to a level where we lose our humanity. Okay. I want to get to town, but Mikhail is on my way. I mm. push and I go. Mm. I lose my humanity. So I'm just getting people back to their humanity. Even if through this, like, even when you're going through the struggle. Yes. Oh, wow. Because, you know, kindness, Mikhail, is the highest form of intelligence. Are you kind? I hope I am. <laughs> <laughs> you can't be here throwing <laughs> a 
amazing I hope nuggets. They and then we're just like, <laughs> oh my God. Uh huh. You know, and that applies in every facet of life. Mm -hmm. In our political life, mm -hmm. in our spiritual life, mm -hmm. in economic life, mm -hmm. everywhere. Take politics, for instance. If you are a politician, you're an elected member, for instance, Mwikali. Yes. And you're struggling to get to higher levels of political engagement, mm -hmm. or do this and do that. Yeah. But if you lose your, if, if you lose your humanity, mm -hmm. instead of doing that which is good to the people who elected you, you'll be going there to amass wealth for yourself. You've gotten into some kind of class struggle. You want to be wealthy yes. through that instead of making life better. Yeah doing that which you're elected to do. The same, to, it applies everywhere. That in our struggle to make ourselves better, let's not forget our humanity. You know, Omar, you would have chosen to do this in like mm -hmm. uh, prose, mm -hmm. you know. You would have written beautiful <laughs> stories for us. You would have said, you know, uh, this and this and that and give us, you know, everything that you're talking about. Uh -huh. But then you chose to do all of this. In poetry. In poetry. Yes. Why? You see, there's... There is this beauty in diversity in humanity. Mm -hmm. It's so beautiful. I think some people miss it. You can express yourself in a way that works best for you. Okay. And it really does get to people. Mm -hmm. I, exp I express myself mostly in compressed form. And that's what poetry does. It takes a whole world into three lines. Yes. Right? For instance, if, 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 if I... If this, for instance, if I, if I pick... I'm already somewhere. A poem here. Okay, so, okay. Mm -hmm. Let me take this as an example. You'll give me that. Okay. Now, go tell them this, that love is not everything. Love is everything. We can have a whole conversation one week debate yes. on this. Yes, we can. Please read it again. <laughs> now, go tell them this, <laughs> that love is not everything. Uh -huh. Love is everything. What are you even <laughs> saying, Don? <laughs> <laughs> what is that? And it's true. We'd be here debating about that it the whole day. True. That it's not everything, but it is everything. It is everything. But it's not everything. But it's not everything. Everything revolves around love. Okay. It is love that has made us who we are. Mm -hmm. mm. But it's love everything, really. No. It, let me <laughs> take the easiest example, Mikali. If okay. I say I love you, yes. it, is, it is just that. It is as whole as it is. Okay. And if I really love you, it mm -hmm. is as whole as it is. Mm -hmm. But if we can do nothing or nothing can, can happen out of that, if we just love each other, then we starve in the house and we die. Yeah, well, is it that. really enough? Mm -mm. <laughs> it's just one angle of looking at it. But it can be interpreted in, in many very many ways. different ways. Okay. But one piece I really like about this book, mm -hmm. in this book rather, Yes. The first piece. If you allow me, I'll read it. Just Please, by all means, let's all get there. Ten seconds. The uh, first piece is called Soliloquy. Soliloquy. Is, this is conversation by, with myself. Yes. By myself. Okay. It goes like, like, like this. It. Who are we but victims of existence? Hmm. Consequences of pile choices. Sometimes products of sheer luck. Taking form by the nature of a struggle. Sinking in the depth of our own pride. Seeking, seeking more than we can ever finish. Yearning for more than we can ever achieve. Limitation. Defining our wisdom. Splendor. Yet our folly. <laughs> being and being not human as perception. Judged harshly through lenses of self-interest. Competition at the core of our insanity. We call it. <laughs> Pulling fear from dark corners of imagination. If we were more than this, wouldn't we be gods? Mm. Never to taste death, pain, or the wrath of time. Still, wouldn't it be a small heaven down here? Right? Yes. If only you valued me first as a human I and be. I you. I think it would be a beautiful place to would live. It, be? it would be an amazing <laughs> home for everyone. <laughs> yeah. If you only valued, valued me first. Me. First, as a, human. as a human. Not as a, the CEO, not as, no. not, not as anything else. But Just as human. human. Because that is what we all are. Yeah. We are humans. We are humans. Oh, wow. 
what is the hardest thing for you when you're coming up with these pieces? Especially uh, in this particular book, because <laughs> the truths herein, <laughs> <laughs> the truths. <laughs> you know, I was, I was one time asked about that. Uh -huh. Tell me about, what do you write? What do you write? I told them I wrote, I, I, I write my thoughts. Those things I see, I experience, I observe. Yeah. I write about myself and I write about other people. Mm -hmm. I speak to myself as much as I speak about other people. Okay. But in all these uh, conversations with myself, mm -hmm. I have more questions that I have than I have answers. Answers. So you just write and then we get to so think. think. This Mind is to provoke you to think. Yes. What do you think about that? What do you think about this? Mm -hmm. when, 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 when Socrates used to, to speak to his students, mm -hmm. he mostly used to ask them questions. And I think it perfectly works best. When I poke you to think about what you've done, you digest it more than when I tell you, Mukali, I've done this. Yes. So think about it. Is it really good? Am I treating people as just humans first? Yeah. Or am I seeing the labels that you come with? Yes. Or what you're dressed in? Yes. What your skin color is like? Yes. It is say that if you are indeed true to yourself, mm -hmm. because here I, I call for authentic solidarity in, in handling human struggles. Okay. Authentic solidarity. Mm -hmm. Because nowadays we have so much plastic polluting <laughs> polluting our minds like it's polluting the environment, yes. the plasticity in people. But are you the same with Kali when you go to lie to bed yourself by yourself at night? At night. Am I the same thing are that you the I've same thing that you are I was in telling public? the whole world that I am. Yes. And ah. when cameras are not watching and eyes are not who crying, am I? Who are you? When are you, you lose doing the title that which mm, mm, you can do mm. when you're in public. Yes. Or are you if under you know, the cover of, of darkness are different with Kali. Yeah. Right? Be true to yourself. And something intriguing with Kali, I don't know. People fear being themselves. <laughs> <laughs> it's the greatest we have seen in people. Just being themselves. You know, I could be here with you the whole day and mm. we'll talk about this. But mm. they're shouting in my ear that we have <laughs> two minutes. Oh, no. Or less. <laughs> Oh my God. <laughs> oh my, this is a beautiful book. Thank I've you. seen Jaber in here. <laughs> like, yes. Yeah. Jaber kuna, kuna moja apa ya Jaber. <laughs> Ebu tuambi Jaber. Is it, is it a nice one? It is a nice is one. It, you see, I've, I've, I've said here, yes. it picks on the little everyday things that make life beautiful. Okay. For instance, if we talk of the, the concept of beauty, mm -hmm. every time when people talk about beauty. Yes. Let me say the beauty of a woman as an example. Okay. What will they write? Hair slipping on her shoulders, tall, light, and slender. Mm -hmm. Is that mm -hmm. really what beauty is all about? Mm. It's not. There are so many forms of beauty that we don't appreciate. Why can't we open our eyes for once and just be true to ourselves? I'm not that description that somebody will, 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 will say as beauty. Yeah. But am I not beautiful? I am. Why are we looking for perfection in everything, yet humans are not perfect? It is a beauty, it is the imperfections that makes us beautiful, oh, Michael. Oh, but where are we going to get this book? <laughs> How much is it going for? It is, it is only 800 shillings. Okay, okay. As affordable as that, yes. you can get it from Nuria. Uh -huh. You can walk into the Writers Guild bookshop okay. and you can acquire this. Okay. Tell me what you think about it after you read it. Absolutely. How can yes. they get through to you, though, after getting the book and they want to give you feedback? Social media, are you there? Social media, Facebook, Twitter, Instagram, LinkedIn, everywhere. Mm -hmm. Oma Don Collins. Okay. Just as it it's is in the, in the book. book. Yeah. Oma Don Collins. Thank you so much. Thank you. Through. Thank this you was, so much. <laughs> this was interesting. We probably needed more time to understand <laughs> yes. what is going on in this genius mind of yours. But, uh, well, time has done the thing. Some yeah. of the things we're struggling with. <laughs> Struggle. <laughs> we're going to take a very short commercial break. We will be right back. This is a full circle with Wikali. <laughs>